But yesterday was, um, for me, it was fine. Okay. Um, I think the, the event was well organized. All right. Um, the speeches were consistent. And as well, I mean, you would expect the NDC to come over to the MPP's place and, and tell them to their faces yeah, what yeah. it is that they feel about the economy and all the other things that the government claims to have achieved. Yeah. And you could hear the jeers and the cheers from, you know, the from crowd the and crowd. the booze and away and all of that. The booze and away yes, as the well. But the, but the MCs did very well okay. asking them to tone down. Mm -hmm. But the key questions that Sylvester Mensah raised, for example, was the fact that democracy must be a contest of ideas and yeah. not just about who has this party color or this or party symbol. Exactly. And President Kufour reiterated that, mm -hmm. said that we should not just be sterile in our ideologies, but mm -hmm. we should innovate or will Definitely. Or For me, those were the key issues. But I was sad that we said the NDC didn't do better at their delegates' congress held at the same, same venue. venue yeah. The rubbish which was at the place while the Congress was ongoing, mm -hmm. you know, in the auditorium. We saw it. We all condemned it, that yeah. it was not right. And yesterday, the MPP did better by providing litter beans. Mm -hmm. And guess what? People still, still littered. So I'm thinking, this is a government or a party that's pushing for an agenda to make a crowded cleaner, cleaner city, city in four years. How far would that We've even? done three years. We have not seen progress in that direction, if you ask me. And yet you will find that you will expect that because they are party members of the government that says we want to make it the cleaner city, yeah. they will first of all push forward that agenda because mm -hmm. they understand the philosophy and they will be the key proponent. Ooh. You see, and it was all over. Unbelievable. So if the creme de la creme of the party who want <sighs> to lead say they want to make a crowd a cleaner oh city. Oh my God. And they cannot maintain sanitation where they met. Because the thing is that they didn't even eat in the auditorium. So how do they the have round, so much rubbish? The round pavilion was set aside for them to eat in. And this is what you have. So why did they bring the <coughs> food in here then? I don't know. So now my, my question is, compare the promise of the president, Jeez. the pledge, and the insistence of the minister for sanitation saying that, well, we are on course we are going to make it clean. Yeah. And the key party assigns yeah. who are supposed to be helping the government to achieve <laughs> their dream. And the government has provided waste bins and yet they decide to litter. I can't believe this. Nobody believes it. Yesterday, I was shocked. I said, look, beautiful event, beautiful everything, well thought out, planned properly, the plastic uh, 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 carriers there. I mean, we should Zoom even Lion be was separating. There. Exactly. And... They just littered. This, these are delegates who are throwing rubbish around. Possibly some of them could be ministers in the next government if the MPP wins power. Some of them could be DCs. Hmm. Some of them could be appointees. Some of them could sit on boards. Yeah. So yeah. if they have this mentality, which is not different from what you saw at the NDC play, and I'm saying that the MPP did better by bringing rubbish bins and Zoom mm. Lion. Yeah. But, during the but event, even that, people even still that, people littered. Yeah. Because we condemn the NDC. And so, I, I... This is incredible, honestly. And, and at some point, I took videos of the rubbish bins that were not full, mm -hmm. and yet people had dropped litter right next to the rubbish bin that was not full. It is, the, it is a question of the mind. It's inside Do you the want mind. To no, I can't think far. <laughs> Anyway, uh, well, yeah, so Johnny is back, and so we're going to see him talk uh, passionately about some of these things as well, which is something we all look forward to. No good morning to the sanitation <laughs> minister today. Well, the sanitation minister knows that this is an obvious good uh, morning. Like the lawyers yeah. who say, this rest is a liquid <laughs> speaks for itself. The anyway. president knows that this is a good morning to him as well. I the see. vice president as well. He said they are reducing suffering. This is a major suffering of the state. Yeah. And good morning to you, everybody else. If you are a delegate yesterday, you went there, you did well by attending, you looked very good, but look at the environment you left for us. Mess. Even when dirty. rubbish beans have been provided for you, you still decided to litter. Shame on you. Uh, yeah, so welcome, Johnny.